So now, dear faculty, family, fellow graduates, friends. First of all, congratulations to you all for fostering the development of so many brilliant minds. I'm honored to stand before you and happy to see you again about two and a half years after my last day in beautiful Sergi Pontoise. To those approximately 80% of you whose path I've not yet officially crossed, it's genuinely nice to meet you. I joined a SEC Singapore campus in 2018, where I pursued the business management in Asia track, tried to learn a little bit of Mandarin, reignited my passion for playing basketball, and contributed to shaping the program as part of the teaching committee. After 10 months in Singapore, I moved to France, where I tried to improve my French and fulfilled one of my childhood dreams of living in Paris. Although my time in France was limited to six months, I like to think that I got the full French experience. Every time I got served with an eye roll, slowly stammering my order of viennoiserie with a heavy German accent, or when I was stuck at Disneyland because RATP was reliably striking, as usual, and hence the promise last erreur a never came. But my path as a SEC is only one of many that one can follow during the really flexible Grand École program. We all embarked on different journeys, but when reflecting on our joint time here in preparation for tonight, I found a common thread that runs through all of our experiences. Well, first, as expected, we all complemented the knowledge acquired during prépa or our previous degrees in, for example, computer science, pharmacology, or varieties of engineering by a tracks and chairs that were taught by motivated and engaged faculty who are thought leaders in their respective fields. Number two, we all immersed ourselves in student-led activities and forged lifelong friendships, be it while playing sports, sharing a, a passion for arts or a social cause, or passing Nuit Blanche at the bar with our peers. We also all broadened our cultural horizons via exchanges and internships abroad, or simply via seemingly endless and often challenging group projects, which endowed us with valuable skills such as intercultural sensitivity and openness to other people's opinions that now help us in our daily lives. Number four, we all strive to succeed in our professional journeys with the end goal to change careers, break into foreign job markets, start our own companies, or simply identify our professional aspirations, with many of us relying on our close friends' patience in reading yet another cover letter or practicing for yet another case interview for our dream job. Thank you. You know who you are. Lastly, while all of us, um, all of us at some point benefited from ESSEC alumni's involvement and commitments. They invested their time to help us to discover our true passions, mentor us to act on our pioneering spirit, or guide us to our dream careers. Their dedication to and pride in their former school, ESSEC, could be sensed in every guest lecture they get held and during every company visit they enabled to help our class broaden our professional horizon and enhance our understanding of current events. As we have now become part of this alumni network, I would like to encourage you to look around. Not only are you seeing some of the people that helped you grow into the person that you have become, but also you're catching only a glimpse of the truly global and interdisciplinary network of peers which I hope all of us will treasure and actively contribute to in the future. It is now also on us to step up and give back. So now also congratulations to my fellow alumni for the great achievements we have realized throughout our journeys at ISEC. Before we continue to do amazing things, let us have fun celebrating together tonight. Merci beaucoup.